Harvey Haddock here, your PGA TPC teaching professional, and I'm on the seventh hole in the greenside bunker. And what I have here is something that happens quite often here at the club, where the ball rolls into the bunker, and the way the, the bunkers are made with the facing to keep the sand on the particular slopes, I've rolled into still a hard pan kind of area. So that area reacts a little bit different than let's say if I was in the fluffy part of the bunker. So what we have to do here is, with the shot that we have in front of us, the ball will tend to jump out a little quicker and a little hotter. So we have to try to be careful that we don't use our usual pattern of opening the club too much, getting in this position and hitting a big splash. So what we want to do is we want to have the edge of the blade be a little more square. We're going to bring the club a little bit straighter back. We're still going to hit a little bit of a splash on this ball, but we're going to cut our finish off so not to allow the ball to really jump and explode. Here's an example of that. Still dig in. Ball in the middle of your stance. Club's a little square. Weight left. Cut off the follow through. Ooh, there we go. Pretty close. So. When you get into this hard pan sand, all right, be careful with the face. Keep it a little more square, keep it straighter back, and especially if the sand is hard and firm, and it's more on that hard pan kind of action, cut off the finish a little bit. That'll allow the ball to jump out a little quicker. This should really help you on these particular lies that we have here at the club.